Everybody, it's good to see y'all again this morning. Um, today we're in the third day of creation. And this is another step of what God wants to do in your life as he makes you a new creature in Christ. Listen to day number three. And God said, let the waters under the heavens be gathered together into one place. And let the dry land appear. And it was so. And God called the dry land earth and the waters that were gathered together, he called seas. And God saw that it was good. And God said, let the earth sprout vegetation, plants yielding seed and fruit trees bearing fruit in which their seed, each according to its own kind on the earth. And it was so. The earth brought forth vegetation, plants yielding seed according to their own kinds and treat trees bearing fruit in which is their seed, each according to its kind. And God saw that it was good. And there was evening and there was morning the third day. Here's the next big step, guys. God creates the land, and he doesn't only create land, but he cr creates vegetation that's producing fruit. As you become a new creation in Christ, the, one of the things that God's going to do is he's going to plant your feet on a new foundation. He's going to give you a new foundation to stand on. You're no, no longer standing on that sand, as the Bible says. No, now you're standing on the rock. God puts land in your life. You can have a new foundation to stand on. And this foundation you stand on, not only is it solid for you to stand on, but it also produces fruit. The Bible says there's fruits of the Spirit. Love, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, gentleness, self-control. All these things are fruits of the Spirit. So God, on the third day of creation, created land and fruit. God wants to do the same in your life when you give your heart to Him. After He has created this ball of clay, this dark ball of clay, give you a shield around you to protect you, and now he's putting a solid foundation under your feet. And now you're producing fruit for him. New, new attributes in your life, something to go into the world. How nice it is to be a peaceful person. How nice it is to be a loving person. How nice it is to have self-control. What kind of fruit are you bearing today? If you're not bearing fruit of God, you may not be a creation of God. You may not be a creation of Christ. Think about it. Where's your feet planted today? Is it planted on the land that God has created in your life? Are you bearing fruit for God? You guys have a nice day, and God bless.